You'll never guess where I'm at. I'm at the Reno Air Races with my pops. Yes, we're in the handicap section, but that's not for me. That's for that guy right over there. <laughs> we're waiting for the P-51 Mustangs. They're up there somewhere. They're getting lined up for a race, and I wanted you to see how loud they are coming through here. This is a pylon race, and they go around about probably six times here, and it's a whole it's a whole show. This is, we're out here on a Friday. It's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Sunday is when the finals are. These are preliminary races, and these are all the people that come. This isn't even considered crowded today. Saturday and Sunday are usually the times where people come out here, obviously. Okay, so we'll see them here in a minute. The top six qualifiers in the unlimited class get a buy for Friday. That means they get an extra day to get the planes ready for the big money race on Sunday. Unlimited race of the 50th anniversary of the Reno. Getting all lined up. The race has just started. Well, they have to go around pylons out there. And if they miss a pylon, they get disqualified or they get pushed back to the end of the race. You know, the end of the line. We'll see them come. You'll see. Oh, they're loud. These are some P-51 Mustangs, and then there's a couple English uh, ones that kind of are similar to a Mustang. This is just a qualifying heat. There's one of these guys, I don't know which one, but he's got to win to go up to the next phase, and he would have been to the next phase, but he had a canopy problem. So you had to ride this race here. Look at these guys. Here they come. That sends chills up through me. You gotta be here. You ever get a chance to go to the Reno Air Races, you gotta come. It's in September each and every year. See these jets over here, they're gonna do a demonstration later on. And they've got all kinds of things that they do, acrobatics, and other races with smaller planes, larger planes than this. I even saw some jet planes earlier. Those were really fast, but these are fast too. Man, they're pretty much spread out. Boy, these guys are coming in dead last. That just shows you how much faster these other guys are up here at the front. They've already gained half a lap on these guys in a couple laps. That's a, just amazing. You know, come Sunday for, for the finals, these guys will be bunched up. Oh, wow. I would not want to see one of these coming after me, let me tell you. They went for 422 up there. Number seven is unofficial. 
know, this is just one heat. There's like seven or eight planes that didn't even have to fly in this heat that got a buy from this wheat because they're so, they were so fast. So, man, I don't know how many of these are here this weekend. Woo! Oh, she's flying. That one's in first, and I think it's already left one of these planes here. She is gone. Megatron board over there. What a perfect flying day we got here, folks. Well, that one's cutting up a little smoke there. This one's flying way too high. The lower you go, the better. But some guys choose to go up high and cut down. Keep one eye on the jumbotron and one eye on the race course. There's a guy out there waving a white flag. But here comes the winner right here. Not yet, but this next one. This one here. Of those things. Woo! Last lap 300 and correction 438.48 miles per hour. 438 miles an hour. Miles an hour. The winner. Okay, well that's it for this race. Hey, there's more races to come. This is an all-day affair. Every day, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You get your fill. You don't have to come out here all the day. Some people come out two or three days. Other people just come out Sunday. Sunday is the races to be at. That's when all the finals are. Yeah, you know, speaking of the Sanford, all the finals, and then they have they have trick flying and just all kinds of stuff. If you're an airplane buff, Reno Air Races, baby. Three hundred sixty cubic inch engine, race configuration. thing of beauty. Recognizable aircraft. 
It is Bob Hoover's former aircraft. Love Simon, pilot and airplane both old yellow. Look like John Badley now, but how many times? Hey, you want to watch more of this? You'll just have to come out here to Reno next year. <laughs>